I think the theory of mind will make the transition from philosophy to science at the point when we have minds with many different cognitive architectures to experiment with. Now we have no way to tell, really, whether a certain aspect of intelligence is specific to the human brain or is some kind of general feature of resource-constrained intelligent systems carrying out general intelligence. We, don't, we can't tell the human-specific stuff from the universal properties of intelligence. But when we have many, many kinds of minds to play with, we will be able to figure that out empirically. And just as happened with physics, what once was philosophy, more and more will move into the realm of science.